Welcome to NFL Week 9. In this video, I give you the winner's score prediction and who covers the spread. Please play along and post your picks in the comments below. Last week, I was 13-3 straight up and 9-6-1 against the spread. Let's go! We got a good one Thursday night as the Titans visit the Steelers. Pittsburgh is a three-point favorite and the over-under is only 36. Last week, Will Levis got his first start in the NFL and he threw four touchdown passes and a victory over the Falcons. Pittsburgh's Kenny Pickett will be a game time decision, but my guess is that he's going to play and this is going to be a defensive struggle. I like the Steelers in an ugly one. Give me Pittsburgh 19, Tennessee 15. Our first Sunday game is a good one. We have the Chiefs and Dolphins in Germany. Both teams are 6-2 and two, and the winner will be on top of the AFC. The Chiefs are a 2.5 point favorite and the over-under is 51. Miami is leading the NFL in scoring offense. They average a massive 33.9 points a game. The Chiefs are second in the NFL in scoring defense, only allowing 16.1. I got Kansas City rebounding in Germany. I got the Chiefs in a fun one. I got Kansas City 31, Miami 27. Let's start off our afternoon delight with Arizona traveling to Cleveland. The Browns are an eight-point favorite, and the over-under is 37 and a half. I'm not sure if Deshaun Watson starts or not for Cleveland, but Arizona is going to go with rookie Clayton Tunis first NFL start. I have a hard time seeing Arizona winning on the road with a rookie quarterback. I got Browns 27, Cardinals 13. Next is Minnesota traveling to Atlanta to play the Falcons. Atlanta is a 5 point favorite and the over under is 37 and a half. I believe Minnesota will start rookie Jaron Hall but as I am making this video that is not set in stone. Atlanta also has an interesting quarterback situation but I believe Desmond Ritter will return as the starter. I'm expecting a tight game. Give me Atlanta 20, Minnesota 19. Next up, we have Seattle traveling across the United States to play in Baltimore. The Ravens are favored by 5.5 and, and the over-under is 43. Seattle made a nice trade for Leonard Williams and while it's not official, I expect he will play against a very good Ravens team Sunday. This is going to be a fun game and I expect it to be close. I got the Ravens 26, Seattle 21. Just a friendly reminder that people who subscribe to this YouTube channel are 98% more likely to get laid. Hit that subscribe button if you haven't already and let's continue with the picks. Next, we have Chicago traveling to New Orleans to play the Saints. New Orleans is a 7 point favorite and over under is 41 and a half. Tyson Badgett will get the start in the Big Easy, but I don't think it will matter. I like New Orleans big. I got Saints 27 Bears 10. Next, we have Tampa Bay traveling to Houston to play the Texans. Houston is a two and a half point favorite and the over under is 40. I know Tampa has lost four out of five including three straight but this defense is still really good. I got a minor upset here. I got Bucks 19, Texans 17. Next we travel to Wisconsin where the Rams will play Green Bay. The Packers are a three point favorite and the over under is 40. Matthew Stafford is day to day but I believe he will play Sunday. If Stafford is out, I like the Packers but with Stafford I got the Rams in a minor upset. I got LA 23, Green Bay 21 with Stafford. In the final early game, we have Washington traveling to Foxborough to play the Patriots. New England is a three-point favorite and the over-under is 40. New England actually has the worst record in the AFC and Washington is only three and five. With both teams trending down, this is almost a must win. I still think New England is better than the record shows. I got Patriots 22 Commander 17. We start the late games with the Colts traveling to Carolina to play the Panthers. Carolina is a two and a half point home dog and over under is 44. Carolina is going to try for two in a row while the Colts at three and five are still holding on the playoff hopes. I want to pick the Panthers but the Colts are simply the better team. I got Indianapolis 31, Carolina 20. Next we have the Giants traveling to Vegas to play the Raiders. Vegas is a two and a half point favorite and over under is 38 and a half. It's still up in the air, but I expect Daniel Jones to get the start for the Giants. Neither team has realistic playoff hopes, but I still expect this to be a fun game. I got the Raiders 21, Giants 17. We got a real good one in the NFC East. We have Dallas coming to Philly to play the Eagles. Philly is a three-point favorite and over-under is 46. Even with the NFL's best record, Philly with a loss gives up the lead in the NFC East. When Dallas wins, they win big. The average 
average score in their five victories is 34.2 to 10. A.J. Brown is making a case for NFL MVP with an NFL record of six straight games with over 125 yards receiving. There is no logic behind this pick, just a hunch. I got Cowboys 34, Eagles 28. Sunday night, we got a real good AFC matchup with playoff implications. Buffalo travels to the jungle to play the Red Hot Bengals. Cincinnati is a two and a half point favorite. No under is 49. This is a key game for positioning in the AFC playoff race. I've been very high on the Bengals and will continue to do so. I got Cincinnati 34, Buffalo 20. We end week nine with a very good Monday night football game. We got the Chargers traveling to New York to play the Jets. New York State three point home dog in the over under is 41 and a half. If you watch the whole video, I have both Buffalo and Miami losing, so the Jets with a win could be one game out of the AFC East lead. The Chargers realistically can't catch Kansas City, but at 3 and 4 are very much alive for a wild card. It's hard for me to have the Jets winning four straight, especially when the Chargers are easily the more talented team. But I'm going for it. I got Jets 24, Chargers 23. If you're new to sports betting or you don't understand it, I encourage you to check out my tutorial on how to bet on an NFL game listed here. Check it out and I look forward to seeing you again hopefully very soon.